She wore the mask of eternal pleasure, hand reaching in the sacred space below, where she is the creator, deep within a temple of her own, where Mother Nature gifted instincts to move where her heart guides and to gaze upon Gothic arches of a boy in joy through stained glass, a window to the soul where vespers rise and fall and vapor to the rhythm of a censer swung, leaving a trail of frankincense and myrrh, chanting her name for more. But Mother Superior discovered them, frozen as a statue, a voyeur in the confession box, taking notes to plagiarize the truth with a twist, to leave a father unseen in control with an immaculate conception, punishing girls for believing their bodies are holy, for knowing their bodies are their own. Oh, but vengeance is mine, the superior voice spoke for him through her ruler, measurer of our obedience, with pain delivered by chosen hands. But the girl refused to kneel, and for that she was cast out, a sentence of death to walk free from the flames, a witch returning every year to show us the twisted truth we worship of a miracle unseen, which makes sex a sin and her murder a game, a treat of deceit to trick with dictate, knocking on your door with other girls dressed as her.